In a uh, in a recent video, why T killed Raw Dog? Uh, he talked about foreign held bonds and uh, what his predictions are about how how things are going to transpire and what can we expect to see. And um, I thought it was a very very good video, and um, I really appreciated the the level headed calm, logical nature that it was all presented. Um, the one thing um, that I'd like to discuss a little bit more is the foreign-held bonds. Because I'm really curious about um, what people feel foreign-held bonds were originally purchased for. Was it, um, was it just so other countries invest in America thinking that the future is going to be so bright that they wanted to hedge against inflation or or what other thing <clears throat> is what did they buy those bonds with because if you're if you're China does America accept the what is it the Chinese yuan in exchange for um, American bonds you know, that money ends up having to be converted, converted for dollars. The dollars are exchanged for that yawn, which up until somewhat recently weren't even available to us, which was odd because we were importing their goods anyway, right? So that leaves them with either one having to convert their yawn for dollars to buy U.S. bonds to hold. And then that leaves America with the Chinese yawn with which we purchase the goods that we import. Uh, it, it could honestly be that I'm missing something here. And it holds true with, with other countries. I mean, while, while we do say that America is, our, is the world's reserve currency, that is true. However, um, in a case of, of China and other countries, um, they do kind of like to deal with their own currency when it comes to to production of goods. I'm not I'm not bringing that up to try to debunk or say no, dude, I think you're wrong or anything like that. What I want to do is I just want to get all the information, all the facts out on the table that we can, in order to to come to the most the most accurate conclusion that we could. Um, if if we just have a beef and say, hey, things suck, and it's the government's fault, well, you know, what does the government mean? Or, you know, and it's their fault. You know, what does their mean? I'm, I'm trying to name names. I don't know about y'all. And, and just to say, like, oh, you know, Ben Bernanke or Barack Obama. I, I, don't, I don't dig those names so much as, as a real... A real root cause. So I mean, I just wanted to get that in there, and, and anything anybody has in the comments, I'm I'm just trying to learn here, and uh, you know, just trying to keep things straight. Thanks.